this long. It's a poem called Hail Back, Hail Back. You get all that you want, johncash.com. I do know who John Cash. Boy named Sue. Fuck okay, it, we'll do this. All right, you're gonna hate me for this. It's a long poem. You're gonna hate. Yo, see, I told you, but I've been wanting to read it all night. I know. So it's called Hell Back, Hell Back. Come hither now, my beauteous slithering children. Let the calls of the bells, man, resound throughout the airy day. Do not fear or stop or languish, for in those moments is where you will indeed face despair. You will face the demons that have haunted you, that have always held back beneath your shadow, waiting, waiting so that they can plague you again with their memories. Do not fear the things that come naturally to you. Do not fear to speak your mind, for you have never stopped from living this life. And now it is time to express them. For as the sun does waver in the sky, and the clouds of deceit have strangled the moon, ever forth more than now is the time that you have been called to action. In this new age of humana malady, we must call forth our aching archetypes and gods. Hail the woodsman who has crafted these furnishings and boats left for shipwreck. Hail the iron man who has crafted these old and rusty blades. Hail forth the gunsman to lay lead into the rifling bursts of anger. Hail forth the philosopher in a time of war with an arrow in chest. Hail the prince in flowing gown that as a babe must take to rule. Hail the miller who has ground down the wheat for our bread on this glorious day. Hail the brewer to lay the wine upon our thirsty and glorious tongues. Who whispers and hungry breaths are trembling on this well manicured path of lies. An army of men who have a purpose and I among them sing their songs of revolt. Herald the archer whose missiles shall sail into the night straight and true. Herald the oarsmen with their backs into the movement of waves around our flight. Herald the nigger whose chains have only served to strengthen his bonds of hate. Herald the miner who came down within the caverns of hell to gain us all. Herald the reaper to come and clean this battlefield of your children. Herald back, herald back, herald be heard through the streets of all of this. Herald back the days in which men were men and the desires were that of what they have made. It's rotting, the sham of an existence, this comfort that you imbibe. These reality shows, these reality traveling wagons of sex and laughter, materialism and gluttony, reality for sale, reality for sale, buying and bottling, churning and spawning, eat your reality this day with a bit of sand from the ocean. Drink your reality with no threat that it will cease. For this bottle, this hard tack of reality is endless. For all realities are set to collide. And this is the big bang you've been teaching. This is the last sound of the hanged man's descent. This is the boom that will finally make a difference in your life. Boom, boom, boom. The loud, brilliant bursts of iron and gunpowder. The glorious rebirth of a chaos in motion. To let the sagging earth bury the dead. Bury their secrets and social contracts. Bury the ideas and notion they have brought us these horrible facades. Bury this complacent, 
bury all of our ideologues, bury all of our riches and our failings, reimagine the map we inherit from the bones of these lesser sanctioned, from the bones of the fallen wrongs. We still got a whole other page of this shit. For if truth is power, then our messages shall kill millions. Let me repeat that. For if truth is power, then our messages shall kill millions. Our truth will bury your fathers, your brothers, your closest known ideas. But do not stop. If you stop, then you will be buried as well. Tied to the millstone of acceptance, we have now finally crystallized that acceptance will not come. It does not matter whether you do nothing. It does not matter if you have doubted yourself. It will not matter in the hunt for something new, something chaotic, a burst, boom, boom, boom. Aim high to the heavens. Our orbs and our guns level this terrestrial mess with your tongues of righteousness. Call forth all of those that seek to conquer, that seek to find a good within this earth, for we will never gain anything from the bones of Hindus. We shall never attain Buddha in cash. A flower will never see the light of day in these dark times as a flower is supposed to be enjoyed. Destroy your television-controlled mind. Destroy your internet masturbation sessions. Destroy these children, for these children will learn to destroy us. They will be instructed to do so when we are old and feeble. The new generation of children will not save us. The new generations of this filth will do nothing to solve. We, the last few broken and wicked, the last tie to the older days of humans, must destroy to save ourselves. You cannot sleep enough to be rested for this battle, for sleep will only succumb you to the violence. You cannot prepare yourself ready for this oncoming onslaught because they will be heavily prepared. Herald forth, herald forth, O children of Adam. We cannot lose our appendages more fervently. We cannot lose our minds if they inhabit them. Cut now, cut often. Cut down those realities around you till there is only one but one. You, meager in survival, breathing barely, hungry, tired, and staring at it, looking directly at what we have come to create. And we have only one option. Now, to save our souls from their planned destruction, we must fight. Raise up now, high-minded, in great numbers, and fight them to they are no longer sharing the shame breath we take. You are screaming over the airwaves. You are screaming at the bars. You are screaming at your young ones. You are from the bottom of your heart tired, used up and disgusted with all that's around you. You are not an irreplaceable cog until they have buried you. You are human until you die. I am with you, my beautiful brother of this earth. I am with you in the streets, in the pulpits, in the pits. I am with you in America, for I sat up all night and talked to her about you, and she hopes that you will listen. I am here with you now, in the solitude, in the dark burdens of uncertainty. I am here with you aching. I am here with you in the mountains with your strongholds and cold nights. I'm here with you in the riverbeds, snaking around the burdens of coast. I'm here with you on the roads, on going mileage. I'm here, I'm here with your mother, who wishes with all of her omnipotent milk. I'm here with your brother, hand in hand. I'm here 
and the lies that you swallow and the information that Spoon feeds you. I'm here to take back the Spoon. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bring me on down. Bring me on down. We're almost there. We made, it, we made it out of the woods. We made it out of the woods. We made it out of the woods. But we're not done yet. They have taken from you. They have stolen out your heart and cursed it with their evil sorcery. They have pissed in your throat and told you that it was ambrosia. They have manufactured your angst, your love. They have handcuffed you to new economies and titles. They have convived you this far that it's the best way to go. Humans, we must converge. We must assemble here now. We must discuss all that has been stolen and seek to tear it back. We must not be worried about kindness, for they have been unkind to you, to all that you possess. We must not be burdened we must not be burned by the guilt laid upon us, by the supposed sin of the less civilized. We are uncivil! Civil disobedience has been locked away into a prison state. Gandhi was left for dead on the railroad tracks. We must dispose of these tyrants that seek to pigeonhole you. We must bury their uncontrolled power with ours. We have the arms to give. We have the means to destroy. We are the destroyers renewed. We are the hungry nucleus of a black hole to swallow this bullshit around you. Herald forth, herald forth and herald on. Scream from your anonymous soul loud that they will no longer control us. Freedom is within our grasp now. It is time for the murder of control. Thank you. I can't Wicked. You're getting up there. Oh, not, not to sit, not to hear it.